I'm here in the Katie Green Room with Susie Spencer, who wrote Secret Sex Lives. Thank you for joining us back Thank here. You. Uh, so, what was it like seeing Emily and Griff after five years? Any old feelings come to you? Oh, well, no. <laughs> Gee, those kind of old feelings. No, those kind of um, gratitude that they would, you know, chance their private lives to come on here and talk about their private lives. And, but luckily though, she called me a few weeks ago and we talked on the phone and that loosened me up because I was very paranoid about it, but she relaxed me. And uh, you've talked a lot about the extra research that you've done or the research that didn't make it into the book. What will come of that? I hope I get to use it in the second book because there is some, if you think this book is good, the second one is even juicier because yeah. I dive into the research much more strongly. Uh, and are you nervous for them to read the book, for Emily and Griff to pick yes, up the book? Yes, of course, of course, because I don't know if they're going to appreciate how I physically describe them. Again, again maybe I think I described her as pretty hot, so maybe okay. But um, I don't know if they know the mixed emotions I had, the struggle I had with what happened that night. So I'm curious to see their reaction to that. Well, they seem like great people. I'm sure yeah. they'll love it. <laughs> Thanks for joining us. Thank you.